So we got YB and Dreamer coming up. YB, actually another Compendium player. Uh, I believe he plays Dark Samus, or at least that's who he was playing in the Prime Saga mm, okay. uh, pre-event last like night. I am was super impressed watching his Dark Samus. Actually, apparently this is his second ever offline tournament, being a top Wi-Fi brawl really? uh, Samus since Brawl. So let's see what he can do right here. Samus has some crazy things. I know, at the very least, I learned from Quick that charge shot actually confirms into a grab into forward air for like 50%. Let's see if it's the same thing here for oh Dark goodness. Samus. Well, that's kind of nutty yeah. that you've been playing that long. This is only a second <laughs> off. Line. For you know real? what? But better late than never. Absolutely. You know what I'm saying? Some people, I'm, at the end of the day, what I tell people, you just got to be comfortable. Come to your first tournament when you're comfortable. But no, if you're playing a lot online, you're still able to kind of engage and get with people. But I mean, there's a lot of engagement right now. And, in the form of an answer, we're gonna keep it real with you because this ain't nothing pretty, man. Why be oh, no. dropping bombs right now? I mean, it's looking like he took the weights off, and that's kind of how it is. If you play a ton of a ton of Wi-Fi and then you go offline, you're like, oh, I'm, this is free. It, it's either one or the other, right? You're yeah. either godlike or you're just you yeah, don't know what's going you're just, on. You're just, you're, <laughs> you're just terrible. Like, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But I think it's clearly oh. an advantage for YB. Wow. He is sunning right now. Yeah, picking up off of that trade, getting the up air in, taking that first KO and only 62% on him. Double neutral air. A third. He did, bro. Dude, he's in such he, a bad he, spot he right now. Down. Dreamer better dream of a win right now. Listen, you can't have a tag like Focus and then let this <laughs> happen to you, okay? Now you need to change that tag to prayer. Oh, my Hope. Lord. Something. And we can see YB is really good, tricky with his movement. Yep. Uh, the fact that he can able to, is able to cancel his charge shot with jump and able to uh, be reverse that makes him so tricky. Ooh, okay, that was good. Yeah. So the C4 get yourself back, even I mean at the cost of a lot of percent. But being able to maintain the stock, and that's just what's crucial at this point. 100%. Wow. Oh, what? <laughs> that was nice, dude. <laughs> I think this guy made me quit at least Smash yeah. once. Like, what? <laughs> who the heck? Yeah, he actually used that tether and canceled <laughs> it to get back onto the stage oh instead of grabbing God. the ledge, uh, which really mixed up Dreamer. And he, he's really lost. It right mixed now. up everybody, bro. Like, Dreamer, <laughs> don't feel bad. You are not alone for that one. Yeah. That was Ooh. disgusting. Why be a different breed right now with this Dark Samus? Now only 120%. I mean, he's in danger of losing his stock, but he's got three to work with mm. right now. Ooh. All right, all right. Okay. My all man right. was just like, you know what? I'm tilt. <laughs> like, we, we got the percentage for that. I just got to get the stock off at this point. I feel you, brother. All right, so tremendous lead for YB, really making a heck of a show. And again, as you mentioned it, one of our compendium players looking to not disappoint. And I would say it has been an immaculate showing thus far. Okay, forcing Dreamer to recover high. He's going to be able to land back on the stage. He gets two dash attacks. Maybe a little bit more percent. He's going to be able to take this stock off. But... I mean, at this percent, I feel like you're going to have to get a spike off stage, and that's going to be incredibly hard to do. Listen. That forward air is not easy to yeah, connect. <laughs> no doubt. I mean, it's tough. You know, at this point, you kind of got to feel like Dark Samus is more likely to get the spike than anything. Oh, yeah, for sure. Bro, these setups, this control? This yeah. Is, this is just sick. And, I mean, it's kind of like similar to the Snake gameplay, right, where um, uh -oh. Snake likes to use those grenades. Oh, Ooh, okay. okay. Didn't have enough vertical distance to yeah. make it back with the screw attack. He was trying to dodge and defeat it because, yeah. I mean, he took like three in a row, so I understand the, the thought process behind that. But Dreamer catching a little bit of a break. We'll see if he can convert this and maybe go on a bit of a run. I mean, 162 to 10. He's got quite the percent deficit to make up. Oh, dude! I, I, I saw that in my head. Like, dude. he has a grenade in his hand. If it explodes, he's done. Yeah. Done in by your own y weaponry. Why wow. B's brain is way too big. Oh, my yeah. lord. Done in by your own crazy. weaponry. I mean, he calculated that, bro. Oh, yeah. He's like, you have this many seconds to respond, and you're not going to have the time. The dude obviously knows the snake matchup. That's that's at the very least. And, you know, it, this is an interesting matchup because you see a lot of snakes that like, set up the grenade and set up that area of yeah. effect in front of them by doing the uh, drop and rolling backwards so that there's a much harder approach for your opponents. And Samus and Dark Samus can do the exact same thing with the morph bombs. Using the bomb, backing away, and then as your opponent approaches, uh, tries to jump over the bombs, yeah. you can punish with a forward air, punish with a neutral air, and keep those juggle ups. But uh, <laughs> it looks like YB. All right. Oh, we got the name switched actually here. Dreamer making the switch to Falco. Ooh, what's see that? If that works out for him. At least he has the reflector. 
uh, deal with that charge shot a little bit more. Well, it's one of those things like, okay, well, you know, Snake, like, you know, honestly, you got to credit that second stock almost as a fluke as far as yeah. that up B not coming back. So for him to, like, realize, all right, well, you know what? The Snake got handled. He clearly knows what he's doing in that matchup. Let me bring out the bird a little bit. Let me just experiment and see what I can get done. We'll see if it, it pays off for him for sure. Why be obviously no reason to switch. This Samus, this Dark Samus, excuse me, has been absolutely lethal. Yeah, and we can already see the the difference in play style as well for Dreamer. He's able to like actually approach a lot more. Not that Snake uh, doesn't, but that's not the type of play style that Snake carries. I right? feel that. It's I feel like that. You, you want to sit back and set up your grenades more. Whereas with Falco, he's gonna have to go in, get those grabs, you're gonna confirm into the up airs. Uh, up tilt is also a good tool, and it's going to connect into back air at uh, the later kill percents. Right, oh, okay. See how this one pans out. Mm, love the control. YB is just so good at just establishing himself uh, on the stage. Oh. Seeing Dreamer always oh, trying to put on some pressure, but maybe a little overzealous. Yeah, that grab out of shield, illy recommended. He got punished for that forward smash. YB taking the advantage here on the first stock, 61%. He is rolling right now. That's character switch to Falco. Not really showing any be benefits just yet. But we shall see if the tide can turn. Okay, up tilt, and there's the up air. Yep, easy follow through. Ooh, okay, my man wanted yeah. a lot of that down smash. Yeah, he was charging it up. YB was just like, nah, player. <laughs> Going deep. Oh, you gotta oh, be no. careful too. You, okay, he's lucky he didn't get hit. Yeah. That could have been a potential stage fight. Into the stage. Yeah, I was kind of sure, thinking, yeah. like, that's risky business, but. Fortunately for him, was able to go back to the stage. Yeah, caught a break on that angle, but not catching a break on stage. YB relentless in this assault. Yeah. Ooh. YB is just like making it really tough all around. Off stage portion, he's able to like uh, harass with those morph bombs. Even on stage portion, he's able to set up the ledge trap, forcing a Ooh. option. Oh, back air though, gonna connect for Dreamer. Okay. Two stocks apiece, but a massive deficit here. Yeah, exactly. That's kind of the thing, man. The deficit has been the the catalyst for all these these YB decisive victories. I want to say. Oh man, I wanted, I wanted it. I'm not gonna lie, I wanted to spike. No disrespect to my boy Dreamer, but I wanted to see something nasty. But. All right, well, we're down to our last one. Make it be this is where it will happen. Dreamer has a huge mountain to climb right now. He's got YB only at 4%. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Lord have is mercy. Jump gone. Is he dead? Dog. Bro, yes, he is. YB, man. God. YB. I can't believe this guy waited, like, over a decade to join an offline tournament. You know what? What he's, has this man been doing? He's waiting for the right game. All right, he's picking and choosing. Okay, All right. he's picking All right. and choosing. He said, "I ain't gonna come out when." You're